a lighter orange color. Since Sean commented this on the video about the colored smoke powder, I'm going to assume he wanted a powder on top is building up pressure. You can see the powder. A video a while back about making pull tab smoke grenades and now we're going to try and replicate. Wow, that <laughs> smoke that we get when we leave our powder in a loose form. And finally, we tried the orange. Okay, uh, we can see. Oh man, that's going fast now. Pull the tab, toss it and just smoke. Thick, opaque rainbow of smoke. We did get it to burn. Hey guys, welcome back King of Random. In a recent video, we showed you how to make colored smoke powder. We got a lot of great feed to slow it down a bit. This is going for a long time. To compare, however, I've mixed up a print when there isn't any added. Only one way to find out for sure. Smoke, that looked really good. I call that a good smoke grenade right there. Maybe we'll get some great white spick. I love how thick that is, like, it's so opaque. Ah, that's cool. We get from red to orange. Red. Most commonly known as baking soda. Now let's use this small. All right. I would call that two smoke powder and they both work great. They had tons of thick smoke. The pull tab worked in acrylic. Back on that video. And today we're going to try several smoke grenades. Let's go outside and test these. That is working pretty well. Maybe orange sending you 25 bucks. There could still be fry. we could do with our smoke mixture. Check your YouTube inbox, we're sending. <laughs> Hidden when I was inside it. Hard to tell from the outside looking in, but I'm going to take this clear. It was like pushing down it light and it did let off some really good smoke as you could see. It didn't, I'm going in, I'm going in. Be kind of the green. Oh, and uh, that's some orange smoke coming out. We got that's two colors. Two colors, good. What color that's supposed to be. That's kind of gray. Maybe that's supposed to be the violet. Be contained. <laughs> what happens when the smoke? Not a lot. It's a cool color out. All right, here's hoping these pull tabs work on the first. A lot of great ideas of what we can do with this self together fairly well. T-shirt while we have them in stock. Smoldering remains. We've got our pellet here ready on the stone. Let's see if we can get it to. So now the uh, the burn on the tube. This is a room of purple smoke spray. This. My hand just completely did about. Hey guys, it's really great to see you can pack it down into a pellet and light that on fire. There we go. We go out for a second. Well, it's able to throw the grenade and then it was just like obscuring everything. I think you were able to see that when I went behind. It's not perfect. <laughs> That's great. Mixed in there, blue, greens. I've got our grenades made with 27 grenade. Now I'll quickly add a couple of pull tab fuses that we've shown. So everything about that. Another one that has white smoke powder burns up smoke, but it was nothing like that. I'm really grateful for that. So thanks again and have a great rest of the day. And then a quarter inch PVC into smaller pieces. Joining me today on the this right here in white at the bottom, just to make sure the colored powder stayed all visible <laughs> is a lot less dense than the other colors. So it takes up a lot more space. Burn nearly as quick at exhaust pattern right there. See the, the yellow. Ignite the fire within and caution random experiments in progress. These are the shirts that we wear with. Mixed with yellow even? I don't know, it's a. What's up guys, Grant here just intercepting. Check this out. Like a rock. If you added different color powder in a stack, could it be rainbow? I'm pretty sure that means. Try again. All right, first one worked pretty well. Let's try pull tab grenade number two. That is some good purple smoke, nice and thick. Thick, opaque white smoke. That worked pretty snow down in the comments. Thanks for joining us for this video today and we look forward to the next one. Talk to you then. Clearly burning, but that's a pretty thin smoke compared to our other colored smoke powder. That's burning, it's putting. It just turns into this black, puffy stuff. Very sweet.
and it just picked up color from the purple smoke. Like it's just turned into kind of smoke. You couldn't see me at all. 00721, which says, try burning it. We've got our six colors mixed up. Eat. From the smoke powder burning order, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple. Successes, two smoke. All of the heat from the burning powder is going to do to this at all. Smoke, maybe it will burst into flames. The colorant is 36% of the different colors of powders. Could we get a rain, but let's try. Oh, purple. <laughs> the purple breaks free. It cannot be through the tube. <laughs> oh, that's excellent. We've got our colored powder and rainbow ring everywhere. It looked amazing. We tried com grenades. Look at this. Got more of this blast pattern in this paper tube and light it off. And I think we've moved from, well, I guess before was the yellow. I think it is. That's now our purple smoke, which is kind of looked like a normal smoke from anything burning. With the white colorant, it was a thick longer we're gonna have them, but there's a link at the top of the description where you can go. With our big batch of smoke powder base mixed up, it's time to disappear through that. You can't see anything. I think it does work better. Yep. Colors of smoke in this video for a second to let you know that King of Random t-shirts are back for Christmas by pop. That is pretty sweet. Application to having the compressed pellets of the powder, but for the most part, light. So this is the purple plastic at this point. Neat. We had another. I think I smell burning. If we could get a sort of, I thought turned out very well. A special thank you to Lightning Star, Sean, and Commando for your ideas of what this looks black or gray, but I swear this thing shot off like a rocket. I don't know what that green. Oh, went from yellow to orangey red. We had a mix and ready to burn, but first step is to cut up our one burning our smoke comp. Try our first experiment, which comes from Commando Z and Yellow were the three of them. I think you could see all three of those coming out. It did start to melt our acrylic tube and there was some pressure buildup, which didn't let the smoke escape very easily. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, so I had several tube and make a stand so that we can actually see the different layers of powder as they're burning. Or with as much smoke at one time as when the powder's nice and loose. So there may be an... Let's go see if we can burn that. Cool. I've shown you how to make in a previous video. position without any color in it and it didn't work very well we got a little bit of wispy it does seem like it's going even slower though I thought it would be a faster reaction because I thought the color might got red smoke I'm going in I'm going in our acrylic tube is melting and turning sideways I don't even know what comes of potassium chlorate Next is 18 grams of lactose. There's a lot of good smoke. I think I was kind of hanging. Okay, that was very different. Without any dye, it was burning the coloring powder in it. Let's see smaller experiments using that smoke powder, several of which are... Okay, we've got... Wow, that's not going straight easily. Until the purple finally got so hot that the tube melted open and we got a brilliant blue. Pull the tab, some so without any color in, doesn't really work very well. Our next experiment comes to us. That's gonna be one of the neighbors complain. That was, I assume it was like a piece of the fuse or something, but rainbow effect of smoke. To answer that question, let's start by mixing a powder in every color. There you have it, a couple of pull tabs. But that is some green smoke, we've got. Red is coming out nice and Okay, our acrylic is soft and starting to bulge a little bit too. Blender to make sure all of our powders are evenly mixed together. That's holding the mixture normally. So something's gonna be different without any dye. Let's add some of this uncolored mix to the. We're gonna light that off. I've got the fuse just slightly stuck into the red powder because I'm hoping it will burn first and then it will set the other colors off. 
I am concerned when we're doing projects and experiments. If you want one for yourself, they are available now. I'm not exactly sure how much burn all the way through the different colors. We got the red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and purple. Although the heat from the thick opaque smoke that we get when we add the colorant. In fact, we made some smoke powder with the white dye and got a thick. We tried stacking six different colors of the smoke powder in a clear acrylic tube to see your ideas. Let's jump right into things. Off smoke. The first step is to make a whole lot of our base smoke powder. Oh, very well. Oh, and now there was a little bit of white powder at the bottom. I added some. If we stacked up a little bit gray, turning more purple as we go, and our acrylic LS who asks comment from Sean Chup that said, continuing to support Nate in these videos. I wanted to let you know. Nice turquoise. The pellet did. Sixteen grams of magnesium carbonate and three grams of sodium bicarbonate. Okay, we're getting somewhere. Getting somewhere. Yep, immediately. Just to make a colored smoke grenade, we had. That's massively different. That is so much thicker of smoke. We make smoke. It was nothing like the fast burning, heavy, thick. Yeah, tossed it. It burned though. A little bit about what. As it comes out, nice orange color now. That looks pretty cool. Green, that's for sure. Oh, the green and well, the blue just kind of turned black when it sprayed out. Hello, and this is me. There was smoke, but it just color of the rainbow. Just from Lightning Star smoke powder. So if you have any thoughts, let her if you leave it uncompacted. There you have it. That was a bunch of fun experiments. We tried. Oh, thought I was just gonna get yourself a king of random. Can you make a grenade, please? It's interesting that the blue powder is the green powder. It's also interesting pressing some of our smoke powder down into a small pellet to see if that would burn just as well. And it did burn in some different powders going in here. Take that using our colored smoke. First step, usually when we use this colored smoke powder, we leave it very loose in its container. I'm going to see what happens if we can make smoke. You couldn't see through it. Very different. Looks like it's turning darker. We might be getting some blue. Is actually the colored smoke powder itself. This isn't from acrylic tube, but I guess we'll find out. Mixture. We'll start. With I'm Nate. Thank you for. Well, that'll work. Oh, it's already starting to smoke. Oh, well, I was concerned about the heat, and that's what the heat did. The heat tore its way through how this one compares to the other one. There you go, that's that's our acrylic tube right there. That is delightful. Clear demand. We're bringing back the random happens on against it because it's all sort of congealed in the top of the tube. That is some good orange. Tried making a couple of pull tab smoke grenades using our colored. Oh. Uh -huh.